Lady Ihama. I'm a citizen and a bona fide indigen of Edo State. Um, I'm here to just advise our youth because I don't live here anymore with my family. But because of this election, I'm in town. But I think the good youth of Edo State knows what is good for them. All our brothers, so many are injured. So many are in jail for previous elections. Till now, they are still awaiting trials. I want to encourage every youth in Nigeria that violence is not the way forward of election. In every fight, there must be a winner. PDP, APC, these people, if you watch them carefully, if you go to their history, you see they jump from party to party. But that is not the issue. The issue here is we want someone that can go to the grassroots to meet with the people in the grassroots, not living with the high class people you have been living with. I thank my brother so much, General Mike, no more less, aka General. He's a very nice man. I knew him a long time ago, and uh, I can see the way he has been doing so many things, and I've seen pictures the way he has been mobilizing the palliatives during this epidemic. It's a very good thing. Those are the kind of people we want. You see, I have a cousin who is in the House of Rep. He has gone first tenor, he's on his second tenor, but he has done a lot in the state. You see, there are presidents that have ruled this year even lesser than 30. You see, these people we are talking about, if you check them, they are forging results and all that, even if they don't, but they think they are hold. We need the youth to come out. Come out and express yourself. This is your state. You want the best for your state. Not for you to come out and say one leader give you one small money when you want chop and go finish. At the long run, you take guns to the street, which is illegal. You take machets to the street, which is illegal. The people you are fighting for, their families are abroad. Check any of them. If their family can even come inside this epidemic, they will, they will not want to. But they can pay for people to come in with private jet just to do top reason. This is not what we want in our state. Your fight in every election has to be your PVC, which Comrade Adams, Ali, Oshomole laid that foundation like one man, one vote. That is what APC has been ruling with. That is how our present governor, Godwin Obaseki, was elected. One man, one vote. I don't think there was any violence during his election, and he won that vote. Then, so why would they be attacking each other on the street? When I came in, I saw on the King Square where boys were running up and down. I was wondering what was happening. When I asked, they said it's APC and PDP. This is an embarrassment to our state. It's our embarrassment to our king. Our king lost these people so much. We should respect the fact that a king is a king. A king is not made. A king is born. We should respect him. Our father and our patron, Captain Osa Okumbo, we watch him on social media. Why people are trying to black... I don't know what to call it. Saying all sorts of rubbish about him. That man has been a man that has been empowering this state, helping the youth, bringing them from struggle. I think if you even check what that man is doing, he's more than a governor to this state. He's more than a governor to this state. If you ask me, I will say he's a father. Just like the way our Oba has taken everyone, every citizen of this state protecting us, praying for us, people in diaspora. I will encourage all of you to call your people back home. Tell them they should never go to the street to fight. They should never go to the street because they were being paid to fight any political party. If they are really sure and confident of their candidate, they should all go to the police center, their poly unit, cast your vote, take some meters away from the vote, and monitor it while it's being counted. With that, we will have a free and fair election. That is my stake on this. And I encourage every youth that you should wake up. This is the time for you to contest, not you pushing someone to do it, and not you trying to encourage any old leader that has been in previous regime, previous regime, man, now only they get the state. It's not good. And so let us all work together. Your power is your PVC. Take your PVC and go do the right thing. And we all have to rejoice at last. And so please, I want to encourage all of you. No fighting, no violence, no troublemaking. 
Let's go out there with our PVC come September. Vote. Count your vote and go home. Thank you. <laughs>